the size of a single panel. TAP665 is 725mm wide and 600mm high with weight at 6.18kg. TAP6065 can produce 21 size column only where these rows holes on the panel. The column sizes can be multiplies of 100 mm, such as 150 times 150 mm, 150 times 250 mm, 250 times 250 mm. 650 times 650 mm. As the illustration shown in the left, the form work can be easily adjusted to different column sizes. The size of a panel TEP60 60 is 675 mm wide and 600 mm high with weight at 5.83 kg. TEP6060 can produce 15 sizes column only via these rows holes on the panel. The column sizes can be multiplied by 100 mm, such as 200 times 200 mm, 200 times 300 mm, 300 times 300 mm, 600 times 600 mm. As the illustration shown in the left, use the same adjustment methods to achieve the configuration of different column sizes. TAP6060 and TAP6065 can be freely assembled into more sizes of a column formwork. As the illustration shown in the left, they can produce 30 more different column sizes after mixed data use. The following introduces the method of assembling, pouring, and the stripping of a T-cup adjustable plastic column from TP60. We will start by assembling a 300 times 300 mm column formwork at 3000 mm height and then a 600 times 600 mm column formwork with the same batch of panels. Tie rubber for the column. Get the panels and accessories in position. Use the handle to remove the cone plug from the assembled position. Assemble the L-shaped motor by connecting two panels with the erection handles. Use the same method to assemble the second layer formwork. Place the two sets of motors in the right position. Connect the two motors with the handles as a complete short column. Repeat the steps until the formwork is assembled to the right height. Please note that Decon Adjustable Plastic Column Formwork TP60 recommends the maximum pouring height should not exceed 3.6 meter by single pouring. Fix anti-floating accessories by the expansion bolt. Install panel straws and make necessary adjustment. The assembly of a 300 times 300 mm column is completed. Pour concrete. Now we are going to show you how to use the 300 times 300 mm column formwork materials to change into a 300 times 300 mm column. Tie reaper for the column first. Remove the steel accessories and formwork from previous 300 times 300 mm column. Use handle to remove the corn blocks at 300 times 300 mm position. Connect a new L-shape motor by the erection handles. Use the tie rod to push through the tie rod hole. Install the PVC tube and corn. Then insert the tie rod. 
install the other half L-shape formwork and assemble them as a complete set with the reaction handles. Repeat the steps until the formwork is assembled to the right height. Install the wailing with big pleat knots. Fix anti-floating accessories by the expansion bolt. Install panel struts and make necessary adjustment. The 600 times 600 mm column formwork assembly is completed. Pour concrete. Remove steel accessories and some handles in order. Remove the L-shaped mortars one by one and the column is ready to use. It's not necessary to fasten the formwork panels with tie rods and alignment wheelings when the column size is equal to or smaller than 300 times 300 mm. Do remember to use tie rods and alignment wheelings as the reinforcement of the formwork when the column size is bigger than 300 times 300 mm.